Hello, everyone. How's everyone doing today? Okay. I'm going to make the music a little low because YouTube does not like that. Uh, did Tony accidentally go live? No, I'm here. Uh, I um, just got done shooting a bunch of of patreon content i shot two bloodline episodes i shot a vlog where i open up the new superman 4k set uh and i shot a review for a movie called bury the bride which is on tubi now directed by spider one aka rob zombie's brother now, I see you there, uh, Neko. You might be wondering, why didn't you cover two? I actually did cover two. I did a solo review of Nightmare on Elm Street 2 and the Scream Queen documentary back in 2020 after Randall Reviews ended. And I interviewed the director of Nightmare on Elm Street 2 on um, the Wishmaster 2 episode. So I think I've covered Nightmare on Elm Street 2 as much as I want to. Maybe one day I'll do a uh, commentary track. So we are skipping to three. And by the way, there is a Nightmare on Elm Street. Yes, 2B Tuesday is a thing. I just put one out today for Trancers 3. Um, there is a uh, Nightmare on Elm Street playlist on uh, the channel. If you go to the playlists. Um, so everything is there. We will also be skipping new nightmare. I want to get them all done before we get to the Freddy versus Jason episode. And the reason I'm skipping new nightmare is because I covered it really well on Clayton Fioriti's channel, Dragon Curve. Yes. Wish Racer 2 is still available in Germany or Odyssey or on PlayStation. <coughs> The first movie I ever worked on was uh, was directed by Brian Heglin, the writer of 4. Cool. Uh, we need a Tony Kieran crossover. I think he is streaming tonight. I was going to raid him because he's probably going to go on longer than me. Um, but yeah, I have a lot of videos planned. And I will be doing some with him in the future. But they probably won't come out until like around September-ish. Is the starting level no Cross of Coronado opening? No, here you go. We didn't even see this part in the movie. Lego's showing us scenes we've never seen before. Boink. I think May 25th is the end of the month recap. I still need to see the movies. Tomorrow, I'm trying to finish the Nightmare episode. And then I'm going to see a bunch of movies. And then I'm going to try and finish the Batman episode. I got to shoot some next week. <laughs> Thank you. Me and Vito were pretty. Uh, but I did not watch it yet. Are you going to play Tears of the Kingdom? I, I tried to get into Breath of the Wild. I really did. I hate the combat in Breath of the Wild. The puzzles are fun. Exploring is fun. Not really crazy about the destructible items. Could have done without that. But... Uh, I couldn't get into the combat. So I'm skipping this uh, Zelda game. Tired with a vengeance coming soon. I actually have to hit up Cop Mike. I want Cop Mike to come back for that. Uh, we'll probably do the... 2010 remake after Friday vs. Jason. Hope Space Cat's doing well. She interrupted the goddamn shoot that we did. She's actually in the Nightmare on Elm Street 3 video. She couldn't stay away. So I asked her her opinion on Nightmare on Elm Street 3. That'll probably be the teaser for the episode, actually. Yoink. Come 
on. Ah, no, I didn't mean to do that. Okay. No, oh, damn it! How did, how did I do that so well the first time? Ah, uh, okay. That's what I needed. Bang, 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 bang. I did not see Guardians of the Galaxy 3 yet. I'm planning on seeing Guardians of the Galaxy 3, Hypnotic, um, and then the rest is like HBO Max and Shudder and whatnot. I might actually start the Love and Death show tonight. There's a reason I'm reviewing that. Uh, increase the game audio. I talked about this. Uh, I upload these to YouTube and they do not like, they do not like when you increase the game audio because then John Williams people are like, we own that. Uh, I worked at rock and roll sushi and whenever the dream warrior song came on, I would always say the fuck is a dream warrior. Um, it was just shy of a black screen. The whole movie, you literally can't see what's happening most of the time. What is that? What movie are you talking about? I got to scroll up. It's Blood Wars, unwatchable. I don't know what Blood Wars is. I like Robert Rodriguez, so I'll give it a chance. Although he has been letting me down a lot. Uh, man, a Kruger at the signing, gonna be awesome time. Tony, you and the movie dumpster guy should come by. Uh, where's the Crate Media Comic Con? Oh, I didn't even know that was a thing. Shit. Uh, I did talk to a uh, merch guy today about bringing back the Tony Peak shirt. It's going to cost a little, so if you're watching this, please subscribe or become a patron um, so I can get those shirts made. Uh, and then my good friend Lorenzo Areola sent me a uh, website to make stickers, so I'm going to make uh, some stickers. Uh, like sticker packs for you guys. Uh are you going to see the next Spider-Verse movie? Yeah, next next month I'll see it. Batman Review was fire. Are you doing Batman Returns? Yes, we filmed them both at the same time. And you would know that if you were a patron or a channel member where I often show behind-the-scenes stuff. Uh, but yes, Batman Returns will also be with the car. Um, it would be hard to pick a Rob White zombie song I didn't like. My wife saw you in the AVGN Upper Decker episode. She can't stop laughing. <laughs> Uh, Underworld Blood Wars? I've never seen it. I've watched, like, the first one and maybe the second one. Yeah, I played a Power Rangers game and Spawn was like, that's our music, fuck you. Tony, I appreciate all the content you provide on Patreon. It's well worth the subscription. It's always nice to get good content of yours. Thank you so much. Oh, we were talking about which is the worst Underworld. Oh, okay. 
feel like if Affleck wasn't there for Hypnotic like he was in a bad place, other than that, I really liked it. Underworld prequel was good. The rest I could skip. I'm still a patron, and I will pay for the Tony Peak shirt and, like, Mint and Riley, a big old blanket or towel or whatever they got. I'm just trying to get the shirts right now just because Teespring is awful. They take down designs. Um, they won't let me re-upload the designs. And it's just, I'm just so fucking done with them. Oh, shit. I got to get that key. I got to go all the way back and get that key. Oh, wait. Whoop. Ah. Okay. Do I put it here? No. Ha ha. Boom. Now I have to find a key. Oh, this is the place from the movie. Oh, I just murdered that woman. Wait, why are things... Hold on. I don't know why those exploded. I thought maybe I had some weird setting on. Uh-oh. The Order of the Cruciform Sword. Aiden Liquid. Honestly, I like Indiana Jones 2 more. Okay, so what's it, I know, other than the Crystal Skull, do they completely redo the three uh, missions in this? Because that game didn't come out much like later. Did they just like completely rebuild the first three movies? Let me know what it's like. Maybe I'll buy it. <laughs> wow this is just like the movie i did not review the winnie the pooh horror movie Sword is a cross, also an X, which marks the spot and is an Excalibur pun. The Templars are red cross for the blood. That's right. Oh, shit. I got to hit Trisha up. I got her her wedding gift recently. Why are the tables and stuff exploding? Bang, bang, bang.
I was cracking my nieces up the other day. I just I was just eating a sandwich. They thought it was the funniest thing. Michael Bay physics. Remember last year's save when Indy was wrecking shit and picking up hella studs? Tony, we're bringing back uh, out Stephen King-themed art show for Tattooed Mom in September. I know you're a fan of it and want to come out. I was talking with Joe about it, and he is down to be a part of it. Yes! Um, yeah, hit me up. Sorry if I haven't like responded to some messages. I, It's been very busy over here. Uh, but yeah, uh, DM me that, um, and I'll keep it in mind. I eat soup like a normal person. Boop. All right. Da -da -da. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, they really gave you the business about how you eat soup, too. I don't know what their deal is. Crystal hasn't been on Twitch in a while. I should ask her if she wants to come stream. Ha ha. <laughs> I like how I mute the music, but now I can't stop humming it. Defeating the purpose, really. Bang, bang, bang. Oh, God, that killed me. Thank you. Yeah, I need to do some more commentaries.
go back up. And let it go theme from the film. X marks the spot. Let it go. <laughs> I had fun putting that bit in the uh, ABGN Tomb Raider episode. <laughs> so I was like, I don't know how to finish <laughs> this game. <laughs> I'm like, what if we just threw it in the lava and just let it go? <laughs> Bang! <laughs> that was more of a joke, but uh, maybe. I don't know. Should I review Dukes of Hazard in the General Lee? Quick, quick with Game says, Good evening, important and famous Tony from Hack the Movies. Hello. I hope you are having a good evening as well. What? Is King Cold in the chat? I posted my uh, upload of Tomb Raider from the other night. And some guy's like, are you still good terms with Cinemasker, Tony? I'm like, yeah. I think so. <laughs> I'm not on bad terms with anyone, as far as I know. That was a weird comment to leave. I actually no, I am on bad terms with uh, mint salad. And Adam does movies. They betrayed me. Adam does movies. Uh, just a just a needless attack on me. He reacted to one of my videos. I don't understand why. And then Mint was upset that I didn't bring her, or I didn't. Uh, live stream my reaction to backlash with her because she lives in another state and she had the balls to go on her stream and say that i'm not famous Can you believe that shit she said i am not famous me of all people me the most famous person she said i wasn't famous so we're enemies. Yeah, I Adam said I was a fake Italian. Okay, two skulls. As Italian as ragu, exactly. Yeah, watch her. Watch her backlash video, full of slander.
Exactly. Famous and important. I need more Tubi originals like the Johnny Depp movie. Well, Barry the Bride is a Tubi original. So become a channel member or patron for that. That's with uh, me and Casey. Uh, me and Monica did uh, Hellraiser Debtor and Hellraiser Hellworld with Henry Cavill. Oh, she's afraid of rats. Oh, God. Indy's dead from rats. Oh, God. Can I just jump? What the hell am I missing here? No. Am I stupid or something? What what's happening? If she can't jump high because she's scared of the rats. Ah! Alright, let's see if I missed something. I can't go to that. I don't have a thuggy. Oh, no, that's not enough. I seriously don't know. How am I stuck on a child's game? I don't have a gun. Like, I feel like I have to do something with these balls, right? I was not a hand model. I was a model. <laughs> Shut up, bearded outlaw. I didn't watch that dynamite. Uh... Do you know if you made it on TV? I can imagine Gregory Peck in the role. I actually wouldn't mind it, Gregory Peck. I think... I think Sean Connery is a better choice just because of how, what you would call it, James Bond was like an inspiration. Oh, what the fuck? How'd that happen? We saw that, right? I tried to do that like five times. And it wouldn't let me jump. And then suddenly it worked.
Okay. Ah! Oh, the torch. Okay. I'm getting it now. I didn't watch the last season of what we do in the shadows. Because <laughs> I'm still using my ex's, uh, whatchamacallit, Hulu account. And I think she was watching it, and I didn't want to fuck up her, sp her spot. So I just had... Ah! What? You still alive? See, I just ha I haven't gotten around to the last season. The Young Kincaid Chronicles? What the hell kind of movie would that be? Okay. There we go. FX shows the older seasons late at night on the weekend. Any summer blockbuster movies you're excited for? Uh, I have no idea. BB Yoshi 147 says, just wanted to swing by and support. Thank you. Thank you. And the best way to support. Well, the best way to support hack the movies in general. Well, the easiest way is just to watch the uh, videos. The best way is to become a $10 patron. Uh, you can either... You can also subscribe on here for my Twitch streams. You get little emotes. I should make some more emotes at some point. Um, I would say buy merch. But I'm working on it. Uh, or becoming a YouTube channel member. You know, the, uh, like I said, best way, best way to watch the, the best way to help is just watch the episodes. You know, late at night, why don't you slap a Hack the Movies playlist on, go to bed listening to us yell about stupid movies. Just let that playlist run. Let us ease you to sleep with our angry yelling. Well, I'm still budgeting to afford the shirts. 
<laughs> um, so let's do that first. But I want them in time for what you call it, uh, VHS Fest. And I'll get some stickers made as well. Oh, the one and Dennis subscribe. Thank you, the one and Dennis. You're one of my biggest supporters, and I love you. Uh, Tony, what Martin Scorsese movie or David Fincher would you like to review on talking about tapes? Um, Scorsese, I'd have to think. I mean, because he's done so much. Uh, David Fincher, I would like to do like maybe best David Fincher movie. That's not Alien Three. Um. Yeah, I would actually like to talk. I actually really like Zodiac, and I feel like that doesn't get talked about as much. <laughs> I love to talk about Fight Club. Oh, God. I wish I could promote those commentaries more, but I don't feel right promoting them. Um... However, what I will promote is the Jack Frost 2 episode of Movie Dumpster that I did. That was a lot of fun. There was one, uh, we did uh, the one for Slash Dance. I gotta hit that guy up and see if he's got anything new for me. But I mean, in the meantime, I'm doing a ton of my own commentary tracks on Patreon. Oh, speaking of commentary tracks, if you're not a uh, $5 patron, what's wrong with you? Uh, or you were a patron, but you're not anymore, for whatever reason. I can see, not everyone has to be a patron all the time. Uh, we will be putting out the 2022 commentary tracks on Bandcamp next month. As you know, I think a few years ago I started doing a thing where six months into a year, I will release the previous year's commentary tracks on Bandcamp. So if you want to listen to the 2020 or 2021 commentary tracks, they are on the Hack the Movies Bandcamp. Uh, if you're not a patron, obviously if you're a patron, you get them first. Uh, while they're fresh. But yeah, if you want to buy them on Bandcamp, you can. And next month, like I said, the 2020 
one uh 2022 commentaries will be there yes they did make lego sets for this movie and i imagine they're making new ones they did a lot around kingdom of the crystal skull they like made a lot of toys based off like the trilogy i think because i have one of them the gondola Bang! Haha! <laughs> no, I don't see myself doing YouTube at 100 years old. Fincher is another director that I kind of... I don't know, some of his newer stuff wasn't really doing it for me. Maybe I should sit down and give their stuff a chance. I mean, the last thing David Fincher was involved in that I loved was House of Cards and that, uh, uh that didn't end well. I can't believe they had, <laughs> they had the balls to continue on with that show when it was just done. That entire show built up to Frank and his wife betraying each other and finally going after each other. And I get you couldn't do that. I get why you couldn't do it. But the fact that they thought, oh, we'll just kill Frank off and we'll make the show about his uh, wife. It's like, no, that's you've turned the show into something else at the very, very end. A stupid idea. Like, it's unfortunate what happened. I understand why they wouldn't feel comfortable doing a new season. But just end it at that point. Don't do this weird, not really finale thing. Don't forget to check out Cocaine Bear with Tony and Movie Dumpster. Yeah, last season House Cards was pretty bad. Well, of course it's bad. It's not what it was leading up to. <laughs> The Underwoods betraying each other is what the show was leading up to. Didn't they say What's-His-Face killed Frank in between seasons? this guy I think that's how the British House of Cards ended. Is there a famous person I met that had me starstruck? Ooh. I don't know. First time I met Joe Bob Briggs... That was kind of a big deal. Made me starstruck. I don't know. I'm really thinking about it. Nothing's jumping to mind at the moment. Wait, did he go back to the little island? No. Gotta be up there somewhere, right?
there. Where is he? Do we see the leader of the Order of the Cruciform Sword anywhere? Oh, there he is. <laughs> I did not try that. That game. Indiana Jones and the Emperor's Tomb, I have not played. I haven't played a lot of Indiana Jones games. I think I played some of the Super Nintendo ones back in the day. <laughs> I know, I wanted to do like a Rocky thing a while back. And I just didn't have time for it. Oh, there will be a Rocky 2 review on Mint Salad's channel, but I don't know if I can promote it because we're enemies now. I hope you can meet me too. Favorite Zack Snyder movie that's not DC related. Uh, does 300 count? I mean, it's technically, I think, a DC comic, but not like they're superheroes. If 300 doesn't count, then uh, it's on to the dead, obviously. <laughs> Thank you, Porthos Colby. You could be my mint salad. <laughs> Was Indy wearing a lady's wig? Woke? Let me see that. Let me see that replay. I was looking at the thing. Ugh. It's woke, guys. We have to... I should really turn this game off, but I gotta see how much, woke it, how much more woke it gets so I can alert people. By the way, there was a guy on Facebook that was like, you would have more subscribers if you weren't pandering to wokesters. I was like, what? Apparently I pandered to wokesters. Meanwhile, what one of my regular guests was Royce from Revenge of the Sis, who has a contract with Rumble and has hung out with Alex Jones. I'm like, I don't know if that really counts as me. I don't know if him ha having him on the show counts as me pandering to the wokesters. And then my other friends, Dick and Vito, uh, got attacked for counter-protesting the Netflix protest against Dave Chappelle. And I had him on the show. And I'm like, I don't know. Not really seeing me as pandering to just wokesters. <laughs> I like to think I have everyone from every spectrum. Some people who are on the spectrum on the channel. Is it just me? Uh, is Hack the Movies very inclusive? I think we're more inclusive than a lot of other uh, kind of like nerdy review channels. I've heard of the Infernal Machine. I've never played it. Mona Lego Lisa totally only panders to the Hulksters, obviously. I mean, do you pander to wokesters? Because we all know you say woke for jokes and stuff. I look, like when Tony talks woke with his female guys. You know what it is? We did the Holes review. Where a lot of, like, racist topics came up. Because it was... Because it was brought up in the movie. And uh, my guests shared their opinions, and I guess a bunch of right-leaning fans of mine didn't like that. 
So then they just assumed that my whole channel was woke and I only pander to the woke stuff and like, I don't know. I give everyone a voice on my channel. See, Secret of the Crusade has been safe for a thousand years. Thor have long and blonde hair, so he's woke. Uh, Parker dissects. Thank you for subscribing. Playing the best indie film. I disagree. It's not enough cat representation on hacked movies. Well, don't worry. Nightmare on Elm Street th 3. I have Space Cat on. She will give you her opinion on Nightmare on Elm Street 3. Change my name to Woke the Movies. That's a terrible name. <laughs> Oof. Oh, no. Bang, 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 bang. Yeah, Larry Fishborn is in three. Oh, look, I, uh, my brother in law wishes to remain anonymous. He doesn't want to review movies. We did call him once in the Conjuring episode. My brother in law is just not a movie reviewer, okay? He's, he's very shy. However, Prison Mike, who's a totally different person, uh, he'll come on movies all the he'll, he'll talk about movies all day long. Ah, shit, I forgot to get that gold thing. <laughs> oh. She's a Nazi! She's a Nazi. She's one of them. Do you think this movie actually... You mean game? Yes, I think it a accurately portrays the films.
God damn it. Okay, so I think I know. Ah, I jumped into the fire. Ah, okay. Okay, I'm missing something. I need to get him a gold plate, but I also need to get up here somehow. Oh, ah, doy. No, no. I can't even come back the way I came, can I? This fucking kids game keep tripping me up. That's a dumb family feud question. There's one. What? I'm trying to hit the green blocks. They're not letting me hit them. I can hit Indy. That's for blasphemy. Oh, that's a fun achievement. Am I able to... Yeah, see, I need him to get a plate and then hold it up. And I think it makes him do something, but I think there's something I had to do back here. Try hitting the right statue. Nothing. Like, I'm wondering if there's just like a glitch or something. You're smart. 
I thought, I thought for sure I was going to need to like climb on that or something. Ah! I didn't know it was temporary. Ah! There we go. Thank you in the chat. People were not concerned with me killing them. <laughs> I was playing Anything Goes. Yeah. for that. I gotta kill this radio guy, I guess. Because he has the key. Alarm! I didn't get any of their hats. Just sneak into their Nazi little thing there. Killed that guy. Got the key. Alarm! ND and Henry broke free of the chairs and didn't get in the Nazi chamber behind the bookshelf. I love how Crystal just says things. I bet he has to edit a lot of what she says. Wait, what? I could have probably met Arnold when he was the governor here. I know it's scientifically impossible to make a motorcycle do a whole front flip in the air from a poke in the smoke in the wheel. <laughs> 
There's the Nazi hat. I look like Chris from Family Guy. I'm gonna kill myself. What the hell are you talking about? Uh, no one puts Crystal in the corner. Oh, sound. I am a little nasally at the moment, so that could be it. Unless you think I sound like him all the time. Karen just came on. This game is fun. Tony is having a good time. <laughs> Teaser trailer, Five Nights at Freddy's out. Yes, everyone keeps telling me. Tony Juicy announced today the indie movies and the Young Indie Chronicles coming to Disney Plus on May 31st. Um, I should check out the Young Indiana Jones Chronicles. I gotta get the trilogy on Blu-ray. I had the four DVD set. Um, and I lent it to a friend and I never got it back, so... I should upgrade to Blu-ray. Have they done a 4K release? Of the indie movies? The hell is that? The Mothman? Blew me up. Love Nightmare on Elm Street so much. Young Indy Chronicles only DVD and VHS though. I have all the Indiana Jones for that matter. Kieran says, welcome to Stank Town. <laughs> How's he doing shaving a haircut? No, I didn't mean to kill you, Dad. I find if I just sit down, the solution presents itself.
eventually. We're going to shoot it at some point. Uh, but it probably won't come out for a while. Just because I have so many, like, big summer. I'm trying to get through all the Indiana Jones. I'm trying to get through all the... Uh, Nightmare on Elm Street. <laughs> a few big summer franchises. What game are you doing for just like the movie for Batman Returns? I don't know. I'd have to look at uh, what footage I can find. Or maybe I'll do something different. James is not on Twitch. You mean AVGN? No, he's not on Twitch. Well, thank you. I'm excited. We almost have the watch time for the Hack the Movies Clips channel. It's almost eligible for monetization. And then I'm going to submit it to get monetized. Um, so that should be fun. Why did I bring that up? Uh, because something I was seeing here. Uh, oh! So, um, at some point, I'm going to upload compilation videos. I know I have the playlists. Uh, but just to make it easier, I'm going to put, like, uh, like a series we've reviewed. I'm going to put on into, like, one video. So, like, I was thinking of doing the Alien Quadrilogy, the first four Alien movies. Put that into one video. Uh, but once the second channel is monetized a lot of those best and worst of episodes we do where we go through like a whole film series i might start uploading them individually like so like the texture chainsaw one when we're talking about text chainsaw 2 i might upload that to the clips channel so you might see random episodes that you think you've seen before but that's to draw new people in so, like, what's this? Oh, this is part of a bigger episode? I should check that out. I had ribs for dinner. Uh, just Johanna and Crystal. They're not as frequent as they should be. Um, Mint streams on her YouTube sometimes. It's weird they don't put Henry in the car with you. No, oh, damn it.
There we go. Ah, oh, damn it. Damn. Shit. Okay. Not sure what that did. These people are trying to kill us. I know, Dad. It's a new experience for me. Shit, does that respawn? There we go. Okay. 
Okay, what am I supposed to blow up? Oh god, oh god, oh god. Damn it! I gotta blow these up, I think. Well, let's try it again. I'll have a wrench for that. Ah! Uh oh. Damn it. I need to figure out Ah, there we go. I'm fighting the Nazis. Give me a second. Damn it. 
There we go. Ah. Damn it. <laughs> Should be mentioned South Park episode parodying Crystal Skull. I probably should. Uh, Chris Columbus says to direct. As Crystal, yeah, the last few episodes with Chris. Well, the Evil Dead episode. And was the Evil Dead episode the first episode we shot on this new setup? No, Evil Dead and the um, underrated Final Girls was shot here. I'm going to do a quick bathroom break. I lied. I uh, peed and then I ate some crackers. I didn't want to eat them on camera. Yeah, that'll probably come up, Wolfie. I don't blame Connery for wanting to stay retired. That looks about as real as the blimp in the movie. Oh, shit. Stop sending so many Nazis! Unfortunately, he doesn't. And I should be the new Batman.
I don't blame Connery for sitting out of uh, Mortal Kombat as much as I like that movie. Oh, you don't even play... Yeah, you don't even get to play the plane level. That's a bummer. That would have been fun to play. I own crazy pills. Why is he not pulling that lever? Why is he not pulling the lever? Ow. I gotta beat up the plane. Wait, what was that 1245? How do I do that? Oh, I don't have a key.
uh, all of Keaton's action scenes in The Flash look like an obvious CGI guy. Well, when I watch, the, if you listen to my commentary, I point out most of that movie, it's not him. Like, it's very clearly, if you watch it on, like, a big screen, it's like, oh, that's not Michael Keaton. Uh, Christian Bale versus Robert Pattinson, Batman, and Ben Affleck, Batman would be insane, though. That would be a good fight. Uh, wouldn't have been able to pull off in the older movies. Yeah, Tony, are you going to finish Tomb Raider? Yeah, I'm going to return to it. I want to... I want to test it um, further away from the sensor bar, like on the couch, and see if it plays better, because there was definitely something going on there. Yeah, I, I, I know. I didn't get a key for that thing, though. I need a key to fuck with that clock. Is that it? Just rebuilt that for no reason? Damn it. I gotta be faster. Haha. <laughs> Ah, oh, where do they come from? <laughs> yes uh hold on let me link you to that um no i didn't mean to do that hi everyone tony shut up me Yes, all streams get archived here. At the Hack the Movies Clips channel.
Okay. Ah! I bought a lot of Lego Dimensions. I want to hack the movie's Lego set. That would be so cool. Tony by the desk. That would be fun. Yeah, I enjoyed the little bit of the Flash TV series that I saw. Uh, the old TV series. I liked that character when he would show up in the new Flash TV show. Bang, 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 bang. Uh -oh. Uh Get over here. Get over here. There we go, we got a key.
What is? It looked like there was something. Oh, there's something up there. Hold on. There we go. I hear some seagulls. Ha <laughs> ha! Star Crash would probably be a uh, Patreon video, but yeah, I would really like to talk about Star Crash. And how insanely hot what's her name was. There we go. No, I haven't seen that Muppets uh, Disney World thing. <laughs> Sala. I'm guessing next is the desert chase and then the, uh, the tomb. Uh, well, my go-to is always Jose Chung's from Outer Space. Uh, Bad Blood is really good. The Ghosts Who Stole Christmas are really is a really fun episode. And, of course, I'm just recommending, like, standalone episodes. Or as long as you have, like, the basic understanding of what the X-Files is, it kind of works. Um... There's a lot of good ones. Clyde Bruckman's Final Repose, I think, is the episode. That's really good. Any of them written by Darren Morgan. And you're usually... You're usually in a pretty good episode out of him.
He doesn't have a thing. But he can dig. Can I break that? Hmm. At some point, I want to, like, go through, like, the series. Oh, God damn it. Wait, what was over here? No, nah, nothing, because... Oh, Lord. Ah, oh, God! I did not know that, but he is getting pretty old, so I understand. Yeah, I have uh, Phantom Menace in the Blockbuster uh, Blockbuster VHS uh, clamshell. Oh, God. Uh oh. What's this? There's Star Wars characters hidden throughout this game. Okay. Um Maybe I left something in the cave? Maybe?
I don't have a book. Okay. Ah, okay, there we go. Come on. I think it's very good for children. Little little violent. There's some guns. Some deaths, but they're cartoonish enough. Yep, the next episode will be the tree. Wow, oh, damn it. Oh no, that got it. Wait, I'm sorry. Imagine seeing Jaw Rule. Where did Jaw Rule come from? John Rule in Jaw Rule in an Indiana Jones movie. I kind of want to see that now. Nah. Damn it.
Damn it. Okay, this should be the last mine. Bang! Betonia is a massive soundtrack collection. Yeah, it was Dokken. They mentioned the song was in Nightmare on Elm Street 3. The first movie CD soundtrack I bought, still alone, was for Dumb and Dumber. For some reason, I just wanted it. <laughs> Oh, yeah, the I Know Who Killed Me soundtrack? Casey would love that. Who do you think? Do you think Waterworld is a decent movie despite its issues? It have behind the scene. I remember not hating Waterworld. It's been a minute since I've seen it. But I remember thinking it was okay. I think it got a lot of flack because it was, like, the most expensive movie made at the time, I think. But it made its money overseas, I think. Well, you got to adjust it for inflation. That's probably like way more now.
Where is the Waterworld stun show? Where's Brody during all of this? Wasn't Brody in this game? We were Twitch streaming that game, The Quarry, for a bit. Uh, I should restart that. I should restart. I'll just play it solo. Everyone's welcome for streams. I'm trying to get more on a steady stream schedule. I didn't even know there was a three-hour cut of Waterworld. Learn something new every day. It, that's from like last year. I didn't archive them. I do think Crystal is off the next two days. Maybe I'll have her come over for a stream. Ugh. There's Brody. Where was he earlier? Lost to his own museum. Oh, I haven't been to any of the theme parks in California. Wow, oh, damn it. Ah! There we go. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, shit. I didn't pay attention. There apparently was a deleted scene where the Nazis blasted into a cavern to reveal the, uh, whatchamacallit, the tomb.
Looks like the one part's broken. Oh, never mind. It's not broken. Uh, I have to check. I still haven't had time to watch the uh, Superman one. But now that I have Superman in 4K, I might watch the 4K version. And then, um... Watch the TV cut, see if there's anything there. I have the King Kong Blu-ray that comes with the TV cut, the 76 one. Uh, I just need time to sit and uh, watch them all. Like, I'm, like, constantly <laughs> uh, editing and shooting and watching stuff. Takes a minute for me to get to everything. I'm shocked the Evil Ted 2 TV cut did not do well at all. I was not expecting that. Like, it's something the fans... It's a franchise the fans like. I mean, the video, the best Evil Dead video we did, did really well. Um, Yeah, it's bizarre. I don't know why that didn't do well. <laughs> oh, he lost his head. I don't know how I do it either, to be honest. Other things keep coming. And lately, the... And basically, just, um... Uh... Just the rotating co-host for each episode. Like, I have to constantly schedule different people from different episodes. Oh, there's the buzz cells. I didn't kneel there. I shouldn't count. Ah! Games are for children. I'm making sure this is okay for the kids. I don't know. It's getting a little violent in some places, but it's cartoony enough. I think the kids will enjoy it. Ah! Damn it. Oh, fuck. What am I doing wrong? Did 
That's what I'm doing wrong. Ah! Oh my god. I think they glossed over the face melting in the Raiders mission. Go back and watch my Raiders gameplay footage. Oh my god. How do I keep missing that? How do I keep missing that? Ah! Oh my god. No, oh, damn it. Do I s do we have to spell Jehovah in this game? No. Ow. Oh. There we go. I've not reviewed scanners. Uh, I've not reviewed scanners. Dead Zone would be pretty good to review. I do like the Dead Zone. Uh, and I haven't seen Communion. I don't know if I've ever seen Communion. I know what it is. Ah. Oh my god. That was bullshit. I still need to do the spawn episode of rental redos. Just try having trouble finding a guest. There's one guest who would do it, but I would have to record it at too many games, and I don't think fans are gonna like that. Because I don't think she's going to come here to review the movie.
Boom, boom, boom. I want someone who's, like, really into the comic. Like, I've read a lot of the comics. I'm at least a little familiar with the lore. Ah! Snakes! Asps. Very dangerous. You go first. Damn it. I don't remember any of this in that tomb at the end. No, that is not Spawn's origin. Sorry. Uh, we are spelling Jehovah. By the way, I was kind of wrong when I said that the thing went on longer. Originally, it was just tarantulas that would come out of the holes uh, to attack them. And then in editing, they thought that wasn't interesting enough. So they actually added in that shot of him falling and you see like through the chasm. That like wasn't in the thing in the movie originally. What? What is this? The lion's head. What am I going to do? There's no bridge there. What? Oh. What is this? There was a bridge there. <gasps> what?
No, oh, I thought the light was shining on a bridge. I thought I remember it showing the bridge when I pl used to play this. But I guess it's just an invisible bridge. Yeah, I got a bunch of Todd McFarlane action figures, and they are breaking. Shit, I need fire. Give me fuel, give me fire, give me that which I desire. What am I going to do? Okay, this is the one. You can kind of see the bridge. And then it reveals itself. That's cool. <laughs> Darth Vader. So did I. I used to look at just the covers of all the Spawn comics. Oh no, he's aging! Ah! I gotta fight the knight. I beat the knight. Bunch of grails in there. Now, oh, damn it. There it is. I wonder if it'll let us. If we'll be age and die if we pick the wrong one. Let's see. Yep. <laughs> Why is it not letting me pick it? 
There we go. Got it. Good, I thought everyone left and it was just me. What? <laughs> no, Elsa. Oh, they don't do the let it go. Let it go. Indiana, let it go. Da Brody. Oh, and there we go. Lego Indiana Jones, The Original Adventures. Last Crusade mission. Oh, hey, that was fun. That was fun. I'll chop this up. Well, not chop it up. I'll just download it and upload it tomorrow. Tomorrow. Ow. All right. Okay, everyone, let's see. Let's see. Oh, we got a raid Kieran. Let's go raid Kieran. Thank you all for watching. Um Yeah. I'm very tired. I'm gonna take some Benadryl and sleep because I did not get a lot of sleep last night. Go say hi to Kieran. And yeah, make sure you're followed here or subscribed for future live streams. I'm gonna see if I could try to stream tomorrow or Thursday. So goodbye.